right, we're back. Back in action. Um, learning subtraction. Uh, Three minus one is seven. Those are fractions. <laughs> So how's that how's that town home look? Town home is kinda nice. Um it's definitely better than, than the little two bedroom that we're doing right now. Um I don't know, it's just gonna be nice to have like a washer and dryer and a dishwasher because not many places offer that stuff anymore without making you pay. You Can know, you tag the tree. I'm not racing. Oh, I didn't realize that. Yeah, no, I'm just looking around for the items that I know we need. I just can't remember all of them at the moment. Um, but I'm not about to rely on no lady for advice. Do you not have a washing dryer <laughs> at your current place? <laughs> no. We have to go across the street to the laundromat. Oh. Um, which sucks because, I mean, if you do one load of laundry, that's... $5. Jesus. Yeah, depending on how dry you want your clothes and how quickly you want them dry. Because, I mean, I guess, you know, if you wanted the uh, minimum amount of drying required, you could uh, just pay the $275 and then um, just not dry your clothes. That would probably suck, though. Ah. I mean, it's... Just think of it as swimming out of water. Wait, do you not hang dry them or something? No, no, you just, yeah, like you wash it and, and you're good. That's all you uh, need. I'm, I'm doing it right now. Are you really? <laughs> I mean, not obviously not the second, but... Yeah, actually, on the way home, I'm going to go to the laundromat <laughs> and pick up my wet clothes. A 24-hour laundromat? It is 24-hour, actually. And is it really? Yeah, yeah, and they have, like, two cameras. And I mean, I guess there's not a lot they need to survey. So many, so many interesting characters around my uh, neck of the woods at uh, nighttime. Yeah, I don't doubt that at all. I think I might be concerned going to that laundromat at night. Right, uh, I mean, it's gotta be... I can't imagine any woman wanting to go to that place at night time. I would hope that... Generally, that's... Looks down upon. I'd probably go there at night. I like the... Like not being around people. If I were to do yeah, stuff. I will admit that, though. There was one time that uh, me and my buddy Corey went across the street there like 2 or 3 a.m., and I don't know, it's kind of nice to go into some random place and be the only people there. Yeah. And you know, it, it's kind of like a cool feeling like, oh, I, I'm the only one here, but this is like a public place, and I own this place right now. Yeah, it's pretty relaxing. What else do you have to get? I'm just going to go talk to her because I'm not going to spend the next 10 minutes <laughs> looking for something that I'm probably not even thinking of. I, I feel like I'm missing some fish. I know I got the mushrooms, but I don't know if I got all of them. And then maybe water. She has to give me the... Oh, the seagull egg. Two of them nuts. I... I, I <laughs> you did, have to talk I, to her. I did not uh, think that through. Get the golden coconuts. Come on. Hua, ha, he, ya. I just want to imagine, you know, think, thinking back on like Haley Joel Osborne was just like, I don't know, seven, eight, maybe. Doing this. 
guess. Maybe a little bit older. So he was just recording. Imagine being a kid and getting the job to record in such a, you know, a big character with a lot of lines. And recording his actual lines too. Just being a kid and getting paid for. <laughs> I'm curious how old he was. When they just... Uh, what, 2001? Yeah, I think it came out in 2000. I would just, I would just let his birthday like around like 2000, 2001, because I don't know how long before it came over here and how long it took them to dub everything and decide what they weren't putting in the US version. Oh, yeah, he would have been like 13 ish. Okay. It's really funny because this is really the only game where his voice sounds like that. All the other games his voice like dropped after this one. So, but even more so, um, you know, they didn't remaster uh, Chain of Memories for PS2 and added like the vocal dialogue until after. <laughs> Two had already come out, so if you want to like sit down and play them in chronological order, one Chain of Memories and then two, say on PS2 or even all these new ones, you'll hear Sora talk super high pitched and childlike in this one, and then Chain of Memories, it's like he's 25, and then Kingdom Hearts drop two drops back down to like 17. Did you play Ke Chain of Memories on PlayStation or on Game Boy? Um, I started it on PS2. I never played it on Game Boy. I just, uh, I couldn't get it with the card-based system. I I'm love probably that. Not, I'm definitely not going to be the one to play it on the channel. I'll because. probably play I'll, I'm down to play it, but I'll probably do it on Game Boy Advance. But my, my teams. Um, I need one more mushroom. I think. I'm, I'm over here doing everything. You can at least write it down for me. <laughs> one single egg, one mushroom, fresh drinking water. I think I need to go over to the next part for the single egg. Wow, are you a keyboard master yet, or what? Yeah, actually. Uh, <laughs> this is the um, Toy Story chain. Chain attachment that you can make uh, change the keyblade with. This is the one for Toy Story. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be really cool to see that though. Um, New Worlds confirmed in three or Toy Story uh, Big Hero 6. Um, I think Tangled is one. Star Wars, you heard it here first. Marvel. It's all gonna be in there. <laughs> Could you imagine just Sora pairing up the, the Avengers? I'd love to see that. Right. I mean, Disney's got it all now, so. They got Fox too, right? Or whatever, 20th Century or something like that? No, 20th Century is technically a thing anymore. I thought someone else bought them out. I thought Disney did. And the, they got the rights to X-Men or whatever. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's true. Because I saw something saying that they should reboot the X-Men franchise. Now that it's part of the MCU. Yeah. I don't know. I'm tired of. I'm, I'm getting kind of tired of the reboots. Because in the last two years, I can't think of how many movies in general just have been remade or rebooted. Yeah. It um, just really shows like the lack of originality. I think if uh, if they're gonna bring the X Men in and they reboot it, I'll deal with it. I wouldn't mind if they kept the current cast though. They're not bad. Yeah. Ah, uh, it's over there on that one. I think this might be a good example of the intro stuff you were talking about that, that irritates you to no end. Oh, just the random crap? Yeah, like in the second one, it was all dumb jobs for the money. In this one, it's all the supplies for a, <laughs> a trip to sea that's not even going to happen. Yeah. Spoiler alert, in the next five minutes... Yeah, didn't really spoil much. Okay. Well, I, need, I think she said I need one more mushroom. 
I know we talked about oh, that the, with the second one, but that's the thing that annoyed me with that. Like, they make you go through all that, and there wasn't even any reason. He's just walking through, and he's like, you know, I think in some kind of hazy memory, I, re I remember my uncle bringing me back here. <laughs> He said he wanted to play checkers, and then I just kind of checked out. <laughs> I wonder where this door leads. Well, open it. Beat it down. Sorry, uh, I need a different kind of keyblade for that. Oh, there's there's the last thing that'll let me pick it up. Show me. This is a god awful draw. The Sora <laughs> one is pretty good, but the Kyrie one is just awful. He looks like he's reading it the way his eyes were going back and forth. Right. I don't know, the Sora one kind of looks like Zatch Bell a little bit. I can see that. <laughs> Sora, yours looks like shit! Oh, you can't update it. Jeez. Right. Maybe now. I'll... Oh, okay. I guess that's oh, okay. He's he's sh he's sharing the uh, what? poon poon fruit. Who's there? <laughs> I've come to see the door to this world. Huh? <laughs> this world has been connected. Well, what it's, are you talking uh, about? Asimar or something. Tied to the darkness. Soon to be completely eclipsed. Can you imagine without the music or the pre-knowledge of any are, of this? Stop freaking no, me you're out just, with this. You're some kid walking huh? into a tunnel, huh? etching over some sketch. Where did you come from? The last thing that you did with a friend years ago, and then all of a sudden this guy pops behind you. He's like, the door. the door will not open <laughs> yet. So you're from another world. There is so very much to learn. He's <laughs> just so cryptic. You Uncle? stand so little. Yeah? Well, you'll see. I'm gonna get out and learn what's out there. A meaningless effort. One who knows nothing can understand nothing. Yeah. Kinda reminds me of Snape. <laughs> uh, what is it? I, I wanted to make, like, a small little Snape quote, but I feel like if I misquote it, then half the world is going to... <laughs> Try to burn my house down for it. That's not what he said! Alright, I got it. I I've got his lines memorized since I just rewatched it. What's the page one? Oh. Um, it's like. Harry Potter, take off your pants. <laughs> Dude, I remember <laughs> that one. Because <laughs> he looked so much like his mother. His eyes. And he has his mother's penis. And her brown eye. <laughs> so <fucking stupid. laughs> well, I think it's safe to say that this one's not gonna be monetized ever. Uh, that's all good. Uh, I don't know how many of these will be. I, I, Probably none. Should we get into that conversation, or should we save that for a later date? Uh, it doesn't really matter. Probably none. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what. I don't know if I want to get on that tangent right now. You don't actually have fans to monetize. <laughs> well, true. <clears throat> I'm just talking about the general concept of, you know, the changes they made in the last, like, couple years and the fact that they're demonetizing, you know, videos for, you know, more mature content when, you know, YouTube was supposed to be just a general sharing for all platforms. Like, they sh there should be some kind of integration instead of just... Um, so, I guess the fairness of it is they never guaranteed you'd get paid for putting your stuff. It was just like a forum to put videos on. Yeah. And I can see that, and I just... I, I don't know. Personally, I would, I would think that if, you know, I was the head of YouTube or whatever, and I was making, you know, money from people doing these videos, why, you know, why cut that out? Because, I mean, they're getting a profit, probably a bigger profit than the actual channel owners do for their content. Yeah, but most of their profit comes from 
uh, premium and all that kind of stuff. That's true. And also the the advertisers are part of the ones uh, deciding not to because they don't want to associate their brand with somebody like who swears constantly or gets sexual. <laughs> pulls out of a video for sexual content. <laughs> Alright. This, I'm making a necklace of Talassa shells. In the old days, sailors always wore Talassa shells. They were supposed to ensure a safe voyage. See this? It's a charm to help us find each other if we ever get separated. The three of us will always be together. Ooh. <laughs> Got some bad news for you. <laughs> Just turn around, I think. Just Riku. Where is he at? Where's, where's, where's my homeboy? Is that... He's, he's over there. She a freak, yo! <laughs> <laughs> so, um, were those... Pulasa the shells. <laughs> <laughs> the Tallahassee shells. Thanks, Sora. I found something today, too. Here, it's yours. She just wants me to get super... Mm -hmm. Dude, she's training you. She gives you a potion and then says, let's go to sleep. <laughs> Tired? Want to call it a day? Yeah. Let's go home. I'm like 12 or 13, so I haven't gotten my daily dose of self-shame. I need my Flintstone vitamins. <laughs> you know, Riku has Flintstone changed. lotion. <laughs> what do you mean? Well... Hmm. You okay? Sora! It's the lotion that's not too go. soft and slick that just you just won't us. be able to get a huh? grip, but it's still <laughs> lotion good enough to make you yabba dabba do. Is that from something? Changed, Kyrie. No. Oh, okay. Maybe. You know, I was a little jacking off with jerkins. But now I'm ready. And I'm jerking for this whole bag of Viagra. No matter where I go, or <laughs> what I see, I know I can always come back here. Right? And every yeah, single person cool. is a slim shady lurking. Good. Zach used to work so at Burger I'm King, spit on your onion rings. Huh? I was in the park a lot, circling, screaming, "I don't give a fuck." <laughs> With wait. the windows down, my oh, wheelchair lift up. <laughs> It'll be great. It's actually real slim shady, but he can't stand up. <laughs> <laughs> if it's important for anybody watching who doesn't know, Zach's got muscular dystrophy. Wait, is it no mu multi yeah, no, muscular right. dystrophy? Muscular okay. Dystrophy. <laughs> Serious medical issues are always good points of humor. Muscular Dystrophy Association sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look at what an what look at how inspiring Zach is being by doing what he loves, not letting the disease take his life. <laughs> take my <laughs> life. <laughs> uh. P.S. Would you apologize to Minnie for me? Thanks, pal. <laughs> In his spare time, Zach likes oh to chug dear. super glue. What could this mean? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we'll just Let's not just get just into that. Oh yeah, we gotta cut it. Go Can you pause sure. this? Hope he's all right. Uh yeah. <laughs> Alright, we'll see you. <laughs> oh my god, he fucking fell! He fell! <laughs> 